the Brazilians, serves 185 million. Take the fifth largest country in the world, stirring conquerors from Portugal, then add independence to make a republic. Mix the borders of French, Guiana, Suriname, Guyana, Colombia, Peru, Venezuela, Bolivia, Paraguay, Argentina and Uruguay. After sprinkle in Portuguese speakers that they combine with the Roman Catholic society. Blend in the stereotypes of Brazil, the humidity, the lively carnivals, dancing and music. Then great the nation's favourite sport, football. Melt in the tropical atmosphere and bind with the hot sun which really isn't there. Beating the bizarre but fantastic wildlife to the mixture and simmer. After ingredients have simmered, dice in modern technology, market exchange rates and purchasing power to make Brazil an even larger economy. Pull in different people of different backgrounds, conditions and surroundings. Risk together to make one nation a home to all. Insert unison and harmony because these ingredients are very important to give a better taste by Valerie Jacobola. The Brazilians add the footballers and mix with the Brazilian dancers. Grind the Greeks, then sprinkle the Spanish. Mix it all, then marinate the Italians with the Lebanese. Put them all in the oven. Mix with the Indians and Pakistanis. Leave it baked for about 10 minutes. Then there is a whole lot of love in the world. The Brazilians serves 190 million. Take some Brazilians and mix it with some Portuguese. Stir together well. Add the rest of the Portuguese. Next, add some Italians to the mix and blend it all together. Remove the Portuguese colony three years after real Independence Day. Mash up the Germans, then combine it with the Spaniards. Toss them in after a few years. Finally, marinate the Japanese. Season it before spreading it over the mixture. Leave the ingredients to get comfortable and simmer. As they mix, allow the Portuguese language to whisk it all together. Grate the Lebanese and add them in. Leave to cool. Add some justice, respect and equality. Enjoy. Brazil. Fry some sweet Brazilians, exotic Hispanics and add a blend of Portuguese. Let them simmer over a decade as you allow the mixtures to caramelize. Boil the rhythm of the carnival and wait for cultures to combine. Add the tango and samba to your salsa dip for an exotic aroma. Steam some sun with a sprinkle of the Amazon with just a dash of rumba. Serve with the 1966 World Cup and allow young people to excel. Add an economical increase of produce known to man. Melt with a Roman Catholic society. Let your dish set for 10 minutes and revive the essence of Brazil. The Brazilians by Lucy H. A. serves 190 million. Firstly, add some indigenous people and let them settle. Then, beat in some Portuguese around the 1500s and whisk quickly. Take some Indians and combine them into the soft mixture. Later, blend in some Africans and leave to boil. Then overrun the mixture with Napoleons and stir vigorously. Strain the mixture, making sure all the Napoleons are removed and peace is restored. Sprinkle in some independence around the 1820s and leave to simmer. 
Around 1888, sieve the mixture out, removing the putrid, rancid, rotten juice that could potentially lead to long-term pain. The end. The Brazilians by Brooke, 8C. Serves 190 million. Get some tropical plants and flowers, exotic animals of all different shapes and sizes. Spread them on the piece of land. Place it on the world and put it in the oven until the air around it is hot and humid. Note, you should be able to smell all the different yet beautiful smells and if needed add another layer of flowers on top of the land. Pour some Portuguese, French, English, Spanish, German, Chinese, Turkish, Japanese, Palestinians, Jamaicans, Indians, Australians, New Zealanders and Irish into a blender and press the go button. Watch these ingredients all flow into each other. Let all the different races, shapes, colours and languages mix and evolve into one. Pour this onto the land once the mixture is smooth and thin as it will completely spoil the taste. Note, if this happens, try to move this horror as quick as possible before it spreads. If any of the ingredients are missed out, forgotten about or destroyed, the final piece will be bitter and tasteless. Dun 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 the Brazilians take some Portuguese and Colombians and let them buy and then add some music. Increase the population to approximately one million and stir and beat until all mixed and soft. Leave to cool in a humid place. Mix some skilled footballers, lively dancers and hot sun. Then blend some banana trees, mango trees and coconuts. Combine coffee, strain the water and add the exotic country. Then there you have it, your Brazilian dish. Season with the language and serve it on a plate. Allow time to cool. Warning, it is very hot and lively. Don't eat it all at once. You will get the urge to smile, dance and party. A recipe for a Brazil festival. Take a festival event and in any beautiful bowl, add a colourful overtone, stir in your own opinion. Put in a good measure of bain vindu and imaginary detail of differences of taste. Sprinkle well with the sunlight of brightness. Heat slowly over the flame of love and kindness. Serve joyfully who will give a smile. The Brazilians serves 190 million. Take some Portuguese and let them settle. Add to them some Brazilians, Africans, Indians, and Bangladeshis, and spread them out. Take a few British and melt them down. Then combine with a Japanese, Australian, and run them over with some Filipinos. Grease a tray and pour the mixture together so that they become one. Take a mixing bowl and put into it some Germans, Pakistanis, Spanish, and French. Mix until smooth. Let the mixture harden. Add to the hardened mixture some Jewish, Mexicans, Koreans and Italians. Pour the mixture into a pan and let them simmer. Mix until light and smooth. Allow time to cool, then over the tray with the base, pour on the top. Create some Chinese and Americans and sprinkle them onto the top of the dessert. Serve with equality justice and fairness by Kimberly Lele